Gracias a los... FHS, I'm Katrina. And I'm Brooke with your Tuesday announcements. Follival Idol is next Friday. Tickets will go on sale at all lunches next week. You can buy your ticket for $4 in advance or $5 at the door. Make sure to come out and support some of Follival's best singers. Mrs. Collins is having a t-shirt design contest. Design a t-shirt for our spring break Germany trip and win a $25 gift card and a free shirt. You do not need to be going on a trip or a German student to submit a design. The deadline for submissions is Friday, February 9th. See Mrs. Collins in D204 for details. Any student seeking to make a schedule change for second semester must pick up a course change request form from the counseling office. You must return the completed form to the counseling office no later than Friday, February 2nd at 7.30 a.m. Please note not all changes to the schedule can be made. Your counselor will let you know via email if you are requests can or cannot be made and she will call you down to her office if she needs any more information from you. Please remember in the year-long courses you do not have the option of switching teachers. Fill out and return your form as soon as you can. Credit recovery students, this is the last week to finish your course. Please see Mrs. Tomasi with any questions. This weekend Maura Drinker will travel to Grand Rapids to perform a percussion quartet piece. The Ticking Clock, alongside with Max Schwartz, Max Rose, and Stephen Andrews. Mora entered into the Michigan Music Education Association Honors Com Session and uh, was honored with the opportunity to pour perform. Great job, Mora, and good luck this weekend. Math Lab extended hours are extended this week through Wednesday, January 24th. Math Lab will be held from 2.20 to 4 o'clock. Please come prepared. Math Lab is held in B208. Tomorrow is the first day of exams. Students should report to hours 1st, 2nd, 4th, 3rd, 5th, 6th. 1st and 2nd hour will be longer than hours leading into 4th hour. On Thursday, students need to report to hours 3 and 4. On Friday, students need to report to hours 5 and 6. Good luck on your exams. Attention any high school student that wants to play tennis. There will be a clinic for fallible students at Court 1 in Okemos. It runs for five weeks on Sundays, starting this Sunday. If you are interested, please see Coach Jonas for more info. In sports, the archery teams hosted their home invitational the past Saturday. Many archers had a personal best score. Our high school team won came away with the second place overall. They were led by Kenny Klein, who placed third in the high school male division, and Anna Herbert, who placed first in the high school female division. The teams travel to Portage on Saturday for their next Invitational. The boys varsity basketball team lost to Elma on Monday night, 57-31. Jason Dufour led the way with seven points. Jeffrey Nags chipped in with six points and six rebounds. Brady Salter had six points and three steals. We are now 5-6, to 3-2, to two, and play at Eaton Rapids on Friday. The freshman boys basketball team won a close contest with the Elma Panthers Monday night, 46-43 at Fallerville High School. Leading the way for the Glads was Colin Munsell with 13 points and 8 rebounds, followed by Jack Latman with 9 points and 9 rebounds. T Tyler Bigos added 8 points and Nathan Ash contributed 7 points. The freshman Glads next contest is this Thursday night at 5.30 p.m. in the Volleyball High School gym versus Eaton Rapids Greyhounds. Have a great day, FHS. I'm Katrina. And I'm Brooke, signing off.